So guys, I've brought you out on a hike. We're on a hike at, uh, at Kleesburg. Got loads of dreadlock donkeys out here. It's famous for them. And uh, I just thought, yeah, being I haven't camped a weekend, I'd bring you out. I'm doing a bit of a hike. And um, welcome along, Mooch 73. Starting of my hike right now. 14 kilometers. to 10 in the morning it's uh 18 degrees c and as you can tell there's a nice breeze up here i see up over there sabina's family all that hiking got a she devil on the lead at the moment for the simple fact is we've got to head back down through the village down here so, uh, looks like a run up here, doesn't it? Road deer, no doubt. That warning. Bouncing around everywhere, obviously, because I've got the dog. Give you a little nosy what it's like out around here. Sorry about the breeze, there's nothing I can do about it. Meant to get up to about 28 degrees Celsius, but it's okay with a breeze like this. There you go. Buzz it up there. Buzz in here at this apple tree, all the bees. Right, heading down. Here we go. Dreadlock donkeys down here. A cross between Chewbacca and a donkey. <laughs> Everybody taking photos. Dreadlock donkeys. Bring his in closer. Here we go, let's see if I can get a bit airy. It's coming for me. Dreadlocks on them, amazing. Yeah, you show me your teeth. Long way from Jamaica. Just heading out. Sabrina's family taking pictures of the, um, yeah, what would you call them? Miniature goats, I suppose, pygmy goats. Little legs. Yes, there was a comment of, oh look, they must be related to Ronnie. They're so small. Boom, boom, boom. Feel like I should have bought the action camera with me and stuck his on me head. But nevertheless, I got my tripod. 
So if I bounce around, you know why. It's nice out here. It's lovely, guys. Beautiful day. Can't believe it's going to be nearly 30 today. But, come tomorrow, they're talking of 14 degrees tomorrow and rain. Unbelievable. Anyway, bring you back soon. Walking along the stream, Tess has been down out a drink. And I found these couple of ponds down here. One there, one here. I'd go with the probably trout ponds. I don't know though. Someone's obviously managing them and keeping an eye on them. But uh, yeah, down by the water. Rain out in the rear for it. There you go. Two of them, so I'd go with the trout ponds. Right, anyway, I better get back up here somewhere and find the others. And off we go. You have to watch yourself on this. You have to watch yourself on this. There you go, guys. There you go, guys. That's a big wood ant's nest. That is a big wood ant's nest. Look at them. Heading up away from the stream. Heading up, here we go. I like up there singing. Ravens flying around over there. Crow calling. That turning around out there in front of me. Up in the sky. Raven. So, up we go people, up we go, up we go above it all, fourteen kilometres. If I'd done another two kilometre, it'd be ten mile. But nevertheless, no stress. Time to catch up as ever. So guys, I hope you're sticking around. Like I say, I'm only out on a hike today. I keep mentioning it, but yep. That's all it is. 14 k's. Birds singing away and uh, it's a lovely, lovely day. Anyway, I'll better catch up. Get it going, get it going, up we go, up we go. Yeah, as you can see. Whew. Up we go, up we go. Christ, it's getting hot up here. It's getting hot up here. That's all what we've walked. It's getting all up here. 28 grad. Stupid, I know. Shouldn't have brought the dog out like this. But we've got plenty of water with us. So, uh, 
We're just crack on. Country road, take me home and all that bollocks. There you go. Taking pictures down here. Up above it all. Up above it all. I'd like to just stop and chill out, you know, take it all in. Woods are starting to green up nicely out across here, you know. I would just like to stop and take it all in, but that ain't happening, so off I go. We stopped up, had a good drink, replenished the energy, so to speak. Dog had plenty of water. Oh, she devil's back there with the others. Walking along. There she is. Stocked up, replenished the energy, plenty of water. And uh, off we pops. All the bergs around Cleesburg. I'd look right at the moment, but at the end of the day, I don't think you're going to see Cleesburg. Nope. It's all trees down there, so you can't see the uh, town, village, whatever. But anyway. Here we go. Wits he must have. He who wanders far. Woden's rights. Been a nice walk. When I come up here last time with Sabina, we didn't do this side. We done uh, <clears throat> we done twelve k round on the other side of the village. We never done this side. So big conifer woods through there. Pines, conifers, yeah, coniferous trees, whatever. But in there. I suppose it's got the best shade, it's probably where your deer are riding up. And uh, yeah, that'd give them the best shade through there. So, round we go. Gonna go all round the other side over there and right back round into the village. So, I'm off. Round on the other side and uh, there you go. It's your dreadlock donkeys, more of them. I don't know if you're going to see them properly because of this sun anyway. There you go. It's your dreadlock donkeys. Breeding season for them. I'm getting that... Getting that one round the back of the neck he was. Done all of them bergs right the way round. Now we're on our last stretch. And in we go. Everybody's down there, so that's where we're heading. There's your bumper clock donkeys. Hear me now, Shaggy. It's too donk. Oh, she's been in there too many times now.
Come on, then. Come on. Come on. Yeah, good. Good girl. Come on. Come on. Yeah, she go through the shallow. Look. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, super. That cooled you down. Come on then, lost kids. Well, <clears throat> back at the car park, totally shattered. Thanks if you stuck around this long and, uh, yeah, or you, or you always have a look. Here's from Mooja 73. Subscribe, like, do what you must, you know. You do you. Thank you guys. Thank you very much. I'm shattered. I'm going home. I need a beer.